Hello there, my name is Richard McMunn from the interview training company PassMyInterview.com and in this tutorial I will teach you how to pass a Java developer interview. So if you have an interview coming up for a Java developer role for any organization or company whatsoever, make sure you stay tuned because I will help you to pass your interview. And to achieve that goal, this is what I will cover. I will give you a list of Java developer interview questions that I strongly advise you prepare for. I will give you brilliant, unique answers to tough Java developer interview questions. I will give you some tips on how you can be the standout candidate during your interview and beat the competition. And finally, I will tell you about further resources you can get access to, including these slides to help you achieve success. Now, just very quickly before we get started, a very warm welcome to this Java developer interview training presentation. My name is Richard McMunn. That is me there in the center of the screen, the bald chap. I've been helping people for over 20 years now to pass their interviews. And I always do that by giving you top scoring, unique answers you can't find anywhere else. On that basis, please make sure you subscribe to the channel. Please do connect with me on LinkedIn. I've put my LinkedIn link in the description below the video. And please also just quickly give the video a thumbs up because that motivates me to create more content for you. Thank you very much indeed. Let's get started. The first question that I want you to prepare for is introduce yourself and tell me why you want to become a Java developer. Now, my advice is to prepare a strong, confident answer that talks about the different skills and qualities you have that will enable you to perform to a high standard in this Java developer role for their company. So here's my sample answer to help you. Here we go. I have been a Java developer for a number of years now, and since I first started work, I have constantly sought to improve and develop my skills. I am proficient with programming languages. I have an inquisitive nature that ensures I analyze my work and the problems I encounter in detail. I am quick to learn new concepts and I can apply them to a variety of situations. And I am a strong team worker who can collaborate with and work alongside others to complete challenging projects and also resolve complex issues and problems. I am highly self-motivated, technically astute, and you can rely on me to get up to speed quickly in the role whilst being a cooperative, responsive and adaptable member of your team. So if you prepare an answer similar to that in preparation for your Java developer interview, then it will help you to answer the questions in a better manner than all of the other competitors. So I'm going to give you answers to that standard to all questions that follow. And the next one is, why do you want to work for our company as a Java developer? Now, the great thing about this type of Java developer interview question is, you know, it is guaranteed to come up early on during your interview. Therefore, it is easy for you to prepare a genuine, unique answer to it that stands out from the other candidates. So here again is my suggested answer to help you prepare. So why do you want to work for our company as a Java developer? Here we go. Although I do get engrossed in my work as a Java developer, the company I work for is still very important to me. I must feel supported in my work. I want to feel like I am continually growing and improving, and I want to know that I am contributing to the wider team goals. Therefore, before applying to become a Java developer with your company, I spent quite a bit of time researching your values, your products and services, and the likely job satisfaction levels I will have if I work for you. Now, during my research, Everything pointed to the fact that this is a great place to work. You are ambitious, you set high standards, you are creative and innovative, and you clearly support your staff so they can be the best they possibly can be. I genuinely want to work here and I feel it will be somewhere I can stay working at for a long period of time. Now, that's another really strong answer that sets you aside from all of the competition. Now, don't go anywhere because I still have more questions and answers to work through with you. But when you are ready... If you want to click that link in the top right hand corner of the video, it will take you through to my website, passmyinterview.com, and you can download my full set of 25 Java developer interview questions and top scoring answers, including the ones we are working through together today. But let's take a look at another question to help you. Tell me about a time when you had to work under pressure. Now, this Java developer interview question is assessing your ability to think on your feet, respond to challenges, manage a large workload and use your initiative 
to solve technical problems. And as you and I know, whilst working as a Java developer, you have to work under pressure on many occasions. So here's a great answer to help you. I was recently involved in a contractual development architecture project helping to create guidance that would make best use of organisational IT resources for a large organisation. Now, the project had a definitive timescale for completion, but we ran into problems halfway through the project due to the fact two experienced members of the team went off sick pretty much at the same time. There was no option to push back the project deadline and I fully understood how important it was to get everything completed so the organisation could move forward. They'd already had problems with previous projects so I was keen to get it over the line for them. I analysed the tasks the two team members were working on and had decided to outsource their project areas by using an experienced engineer from the website Upwork.com. I chose a top rated engineer at a competitive price and I provided a clear and definitive brief of what needed to be done and by what time frame. Now, by using my initiative, by remaining calm and by focusing purely on completing the project to a high standard, I was able to get everything finished and submitted to the IT manager just before the deadline. So that shows that you can respond positively to challenging situations. You don't just pass it on to someone else to deal with. You use your initiative, you think outside the box and you get the project or the task completed. Here's the next question. What is meant by the term platform independent and how is it related to Java? Now, of course, in addition to preparing answers to motivational and behavioral type Java developer interview questions, you will also need to answer a number of technical related questions too. So here's my suggested answer to this common Java developer interview question. The term platform independent means that a programming language is dependent on any one platform to run. In other words, once the code has been compiled, it can then be executed on any platform or operating system. One of the great things about Java is that it is platform independent. It achieves this because the Java compiler is able to convert code to bytecode. This bytecode can then run on any operating system or platform using Java Virtual Machine JVM. Another example of a Java developer technical question is in Java, what is meant by the term wrapper classes? Now, wrapper classes are used in Java to create objects. Essentially, they tell Java primitives to change into reference types objects. The reason it gets the name wrapper classes is because they wrap around the primitive data to form an object in the class of the primitive data that has been associated to it. So those are two examples of Java technical questions. I'll tell you where you can get more questions and answers in a second. But let's move back to another Java developer common motivational question. And that is, why should we hire you in this Java developer role? Now, again, this is another guaranteed Java developer interview question that will feature towards the end of your particular interview. Here's a great way to answer it. Here we go. I believe you should hire me because not only is my technical competence to a high standard, I am also commercially aware and I understand I need to perform to a consistently high standard for you to succeed as a business. I am also flexible, a supportive collaborator and team worker and somebody who can be left alone to get on with their work safe in the knowledge it will be done on time and to the right standard. I fully appreciate you have lots of Java developers to choose from I genuinely feel I am the perfect candidate due to my diverse range of skills, my technical expertise and my strong interpersonal and team working capabilities. That's a really strong, positive and confident answer that is likely to impress the hiring manager. Now, the next thing to do is please do click that link in the top right hand corner of the video. Go through to my website, passmainterview.com. Take a look at my 25 Java developer interview questions. On that page, I've listed motivational questions, behavioural questions, and also more technical related questions for you to prepare for when um, before you go along to your Java developer interview. You also have the option to download all of the answers in PDF format so you can have them within your inbox within two minutes from now. I hope you've enjoyed that. I love teaching you guys. Thank you very much for watching and paying attention. Don't forget to please subscribe, connect with me on LinkedIn and give the video a thumbs up. Thank you very much. And I wish you all the best for passing your Java developer interview. Have a brilliant day.